Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Vehicle Legends today on the channel. I hope you guys are having a great day. Today we are taking a look at the April Fools update that just came out yesterday. Um, I'm going to be uploading this past April Fools, but I think the car is here to stay. I'm not entirely sure, but I think it's here to stay. So we're going to go ahead and check it out today. And I think there's a couple of other things that were added in this update as well. But for the most part, this is mostly just about the new car. So let's go ahead and take a look at that first and guys this is it right here the egg mobile so this is a motorcycle apparently um, and it is of course in the shape of an Easter egg so this is the new vehicle in the game guys I don't really know if it's gonna be that great so by taking a look at the stats I know you guys can't see them but it has a top speed of 155 miles an hour it has 228 horsepower and a pretty slow launch but you have a couple of options here you guys can of course change the color of the egg if that's something that you want to do um, we could go with like orange we could even do white or whatever we want there's a lot of different options uh, and then rim colors as well you can change that this is a very simple little fun uh, item you can get in the game now I don't really think it's that serious I don't know if it's here to stay but I think it would suck if people bought it and then it was just removed from the inventory so if nothing else you will at least have a very unique vehicle so this is it guys this is the new vehicle in the game the uh, the egg mobile this thing looks kind of cool it's uh it's it's an egg it's hard to talk about this thing <laughs> it's literally just an egg but well, we're gonna go ahead and see what it can do it feels pretty fast we haven't played this game in a long time so i'm excited to see if there's anything else that we're gonna notice that's new i will say um the material that's used on the egg has this really cool looking reflection where you can basically see the entire sky above it so it kind of looks like in a way um, it, it almost looks like an earth in the sense of like how the sky is turned into like a sphere It looks awesome. Either way. Let's see what this thing can do. Let's test its top speed It comes with boost uh, totally stock, which is kind of cool and it is pretty fast I mean we are going 140. Oh man. Okay. We aren't even at the top speed yet So it's turning radius if you haven't noticed already is pretty crazy um, It turns pretty sharp. So it's probably not gonna be the best for a lot of races but uh yeah it can go up to over 150 miles an hour but i think what we should do today is probably just take a look around the map see what see what's new a couple of things i have noticed uh is this little premium box here you guys can click on this above the chat and it says if you own premium you get a couple of benefits like an icon you earn extra money stuff like that and then we have this this looks pretty new it's actually kind of cool um it's a profile of your history on uh on vehicle legends you guys can see how many races you've won when you started playing the game and uh, the miles driven it's crazy that i started playing this game back in june of last year i can't believe this game has been out for that long something else to look at is actually if we go towards the mountains i think there's something going on over here somebody showed me um the developer of the game is working on like a new map area or something like that i don't really know the details but i'm pretty sure it's in the mountains um so maybe this kind of plays some sort of hint towards that i don't really know uh it does look pretty cool though and if, and if they add roads through there it's gonna be kind of neat but uh yeah here we go we're gonna keep going it is daytime again so let's see what we can do guys i'm gonna of course max this vehicle out i just wanted to show you guys i don't really explore this map very often um and i feel like we should because it's pretty beautiful actually there's a lot of cool spots the map has seen a lot of improvements and uh, i don't think he always talks about them yeah whatever updates are coming in the future i'm looking forward to it it would be cool if there was like some sort of reasoning behind going to different areas on the map uh especially like areas like this it's a really nice part of the map but nobody seems to drive over here i didn't even know it existed so if they added something that kind of gave you reasons to explore that would be kind of cool um, either way, here we are in the, uh, the race festival. Let's see if people are racing. If not, we're gonna have to go to another server. Let's see. Okay, so we got a couple of people here together to do the highway race. Um, it looks like we have the C8 Corvette an Aventador and a BMW i8 maybe or maybe something else I don't know it kind of looks like an i8 from the back uh, this should be kind of cool I don't know if this thing can win against these guys they have pretty nice cars but let's see what we can do hopefully we can get better than last all right here we go four cars in the lineup I'm the only one with a friggin egg as a vehicle but let's see how this goes 
Uh, this is of course only stock. After this, we're gonna go ahead and max it out and then see what it can do. I will say it would be pretty neat if this thing could uh, could be a couple of supercars today when it's fully maxed out. But so far, it's uh, it's doing all right. The Corvette C8 just starts to pass us. Okay, yeah, this is last place. We are going to do a lot of improvements because it's still pretty slow, even though uh, it goes 150 miles an hour. Okay, here we are in the garage. Um, we have a couple of options here. We could go ahead and change the skin of the vehicle, which would be kind of cool. I mean, you can make your eggs seem pretty crazy with this. Uh, let's not do that though, and just keep it kind of basic um, skins. You can change the material as well if you guys wanted to spend Robux or whatever. So uh, yeah, we'll keep it with maybe glossy. I think this is what it came with. Uh, and the paint colors, we have a bunch of different options. We could go with a brighter red or like a bright green, uh, maybe the bright red. For rims, all you can do is change colors, so nothing too crazy there. Uh, there isn't really headlights, so I don't really see a purpose in that, but uh, let's see what else we got. We can do underglow. Okay, this is kind of cool. Let's see what the underglow looks like. Okay, so I can't really see if the underglow works. Um, we'll see later on, but uh, let's go ahead and change, obviously, the seats. Okay, so apparently you can supercharge this thing. Um, wow, this is amazing. Uh, All-wheel drive. Okay, I don't know what that's going to do to the way the car performs, but let's see. It only has two wheels, so uh, I don't know how that's going to react. But here we go. We're going to get some pro brakes and uh pro transmission or should we do racing transmission i don't know i think pro is probably the best and uh i guess for tires we'll just grab the drag tires they're the most expensive so they're probably going to be the best we don't have to touch suspension so let's go ahead and uh yeah this thing should be pretty friggin fast now let's go to the highway and see what it can do oh did we make it okay we made it in time to do the drag race somebody else is in their motorcycle um not the egg motorcycle just a regular one and there's an audi as well well as I guess like a C7 Corvette or maybe that's a C8. Yo, this egg is actually surprisingly pretty fast. Here we go. Are we gonna get first? Uh, no, we didn't get first. We actually lost by 0.3 seconds. I feel like we could do better. Let's see if we can get a better time. Alrighty, attempt number two, same people. Uh, let's see if we can get a better time this time. Here we go. I gotta use the boost a little bit better. Here we go. Uh, there we go. Use it again and use it again. Okay. Did we win? We did win. We got a much better time. So 7.1 is uh, the best we're going to get in the quarter mile. That's pretty good. I mean, it is like a literally a pretty cheap vehicle fully maxed out. You're probably looking at like hundred K or something like that. So not too bad. Alrighty, let's give the highway race another shot. We still have a lot of really, really fast cars. Since we're mostly maxed out, I think we will end up doing much, much better. So let's see. We have a C8, um, um, I'm not sure what that other one is, but anyways, let's go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Hopefully we can get like second place or third. I don't know. These guys are pretty fast, but so is this little egg thing. Uh, our, our biggest problem is definitely the fact that our top speed is only 170. Um, that is going to be the thing that gets us in last. Unfortunately, the other cars here go way, way, way higher in the top speed. So yeah, even the Corvette is starting to catch up only because of top speed. As far as acceleration goes, this thing is pretty good. So if you buy this thing, it's not the best for the highway, but for the drag races, it's pretty fun, I guess. So there you go. That is basically the uh, the Eggmobile, as they call it in this game. Either way, guys, I'm going to wrap up the video here. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you guys did, make sure to leave it a big thumbs up. Let me know if you guys want more Vehicle Legends. We do not play this game very often anymore. Um, I just I haven't found a lot of things to do. We've basically done it all. So if you guys have any ideas, just let me know. Oh my god. And I'll see you all in the next video.